Welcome to our deep dive into the future of ethical hacking, brought to you by Index Cyber. If you're passionate about cybersecurity and want to stay ahead of the curve, you're in the right place. Today we're exploring the top 5 Wi-Fi adapters that are not just tools but game-changers in the world of ethical hacking. In an ever-evolving digital landscape, having the right gear can make all the difference. Whether you're a seasoned pro or just getting started, the right Wi-Fi adapter can elevate your penetration testing to new heights. So, buckle up and get ready to discover the best of the best in Wi-Fi adapters for 2025. Let's make sure you're equipped with the tools you need to stay ethical, stay curious, and most importantly, stay ahead. In this video, we'll dive into the top 5 Wi-Fi adapters that are game changers for ethical hacking. Alright, let's kick things off with the undisputed king of Wi-Fi adapters for hacking. The Alpha AWS 036 AXML. This beast is an absolute unit, and when I say unit, I mean it in both size and performance. Seriously, this thing is huge, but don't let that fool you. It's packing some serious heat under the hood. First off, we're talking Wi-Fi 6 support. You're future-proofed for the next generation of wireless networks, which is crucial in the fast-paced world of cybersecurity. But it's not just about the future, this adapter dominates the present as well. The dual-band capability means you can switch between 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz frequencies, giving you flexibility and wider range to work with. And speaking of range, this thing is a monster. You can sniff out networks from miles away, okay, maybe not miles, but you get the point. Now, let's talk about the heart of this beast, the MediaTek MT7921U chipset. This chipset is a game-changer for ethical hacking. It unlocks monitor mode, which lets you see all the wireless traffic going on around you, not just your own. And of course, it supports packet injection, the bread and butter of many penetration testing techniques. The best part is, with the latest Kali Linux updates, getting this adapter up and running is a breeze. The drivers are baked right in, so you can jump straight into your ethical hacking endeavors without wasting time on tedious setup. Look, if you're serious about ethical hacking and you want the best possible Wi-Fi adapter on the market, the Alpha AWS 036 AXML is a no-brainer. It's an investment for sure, but trust me, the performance, compatibility, and future-proofing you get are worth every penny. Next up we have the TP-Link Archer T9 UHV-2, a fantastic mid-range option that balances performance and affordability. Now it might not be as flashy or as powerful as the Alpha, but don't underestimate this compact powerhouse. It's still an incredibly capable adapter that can hold its own in the world of ethical hacking. One of the things I love about this adapter is its size. It's super compact and unobtrusive, which is perfect if you're on the go or working with limited desk space. But don't let the small size fool you, it's still packing a punch when it comes to performance. The TP-Link Archer T9 UHV2 is rocking a Realtek RTL 8814AU chipset, which while not as feature-packed as the MediaTek in the Alpha, still gets the job done for most ethical hacking tasks. You get solid dual-band support, decent range, and most importantly, both monitor mode and packet injection are supported. Now, I will say that getting this adapter to play nicely with Kali Linux might require a little bit more effort compared to the plug-and-play experience of the Alpha. You might need to install some third-party drivers or do a bit of tweaking in the terminal, but trust me, it's nothing too complicated. There are tons of tutorials online, and once you're set up, you're good to go. Overall, the TP-Link Archer T9 UHV2 is a fantastic choice for anyone looking for a reliable and affordable Wi-Fi adapter that can handle the majority of ethical hacking tasks. It's perfect for beginners who are just starting out and don't want to break the bank, or even seasoned professionals looking for a solid secondary adapter. Now let's talk about an adapter that's near and dear to my heart, especially for those just starting their ethical hacking journey. The Panda Wireless PAU-09. This little guy is a classic for a reason, it's affordable, it's easy to use, and it's perfect for learning the ropes of wireless penetration testing. I know what you're thinking, why are you recommending a Wi-Fi 4 adapter in 2025? And it's a fair question. We're in a world of Wi-Fi 6 and even Wi-Fi 7 on the horizon, so why go with an older standard? Well, here's the thing. While it's true that the PAU-09 is limited to Wi-Fi 4 or 802.11n, it's still more than capable of handling the basic techniques you need to master as a beginner. 
We're talking about capturing packets, setting up rogue access points, and practicing your injection skills. And the beauty of this adapter is that it just works with Kaylee Linux. Plug it in, and you're good to go. No driver hunting, no command line wizardry required. It's the perfect plug and play option for beginners. Plus, the price point is unbeatable. You can find this adapter for a steal, which means you can invest more of your budget into other essential hacking tools or training materials. Trust me, when you're starting out, every penny counts. So, if you're new to ethical hacking and looking for an affordable and beginner-friendly Wi-Fi adapter to cut your teeth on, the Panda Wireless PAU09 is an excellent choice. It might not be the flashiest or most powerful adapter on the market, but it's a fantastic learning tool that won't break the bank. Let's move on to another classic, an adapter that's been a staple in the ethical hacking community for years, the Alpha AWS 036 ACH. This bad boy has been around the block a few times, but don't let its age fool you, it's still got it where it counts. One of the things that made this adapter so popular was its sheer power and range. We're talking about an external adapter with two massive antennas that can pick up networks from what feels like miles away. And when I say it's powerful, I mean it. This thing can blast through interference like it's nothing, which is crucial when you're trying to penetrate a network from a distance. At the heart of this beast is the RTL 8812 AU chipset. Now, while it's not the newest chipset on the block, it's still widely supported in the ethical hacking community. What does that mean for you? It means you'll find tons of tutorials, guides, and resources online for getting this adapter up and running with Kaylee Linux and using it for all sorts of penetration testing goodness. Speaking of Kaylee Linux, you might need to do a little bit of driver juggling to get everything working smoothly, but hey, that's part of the fun, right? In all seriousness, the Alpha AWS 036 ACH is a testament to the saying, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. It's a powerful, reliable, and widely supported adapter that's still relevant in 2025, and the best part is, you can often find it at a discounted price since it's been out for a while. So, if you're looking for a tried-and-true adapter with a proven track record, the Alpha AWS 036 ACH is definitely worth considering. Last but not least, we have a bit of a sleeper hit, an adapter that often flies under the radar but packs a serious punch for its price, the Fenvi AC1300 USB adapter. Now, you might not have heard of Fenvi before and that's okay, but trust me, this adapter deserves a spot on your list, especially if you're on a budget. One of the things that surprised me about this adapter is its performance. It's rocking the RTL 8812BU chipset, which, while not as fancy as some of the newer chipsets out there, is still more than capable of handling most ethical hacking tasks. We're talking about monitor mode, packet injection, the whole nine yards. And don't let the USB form factor fool you, this thing can still pick up a surprising number of networks, even at a distance. Now here's the catch out of the box. This adapter might not play nicely with Kali Linux, you'll likely need to install some third-party drivers, but don't worry, it's not as daunting as it sounds. The ethical hacking community is awesome, and you'll find tons of resources and tutorials online to guide you through the process. Once you're all set up, you'll be amazed by the performance you can squeeze out of this budget-friendly adapter. For the price, the Fenby AC 1300 USB adapter is an absolute steal. It's a fantastic option for anyone on a tight budget or just starting out in the world of ethical hacking. You get solid performance, compatibility with Kali Linux with a little bit of tweaking, and all of this without breaking the bank. You really can't go wrong with this one. Remember, always use your tools ethically and only on networks you own or have permission to test. Let me know in the comments which adapter you use or plan to buy. If you found this video helpful, give it a like. Don't forget to subscribe to Index Cyber and hit that bell icon so you never miss out on the latest in ethical hacking, cyber tools, and tutorials. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.